All right, there you go. Yeah, so um, historically, this matchup was kind of doo-doo for Fox. Fox kind of gets blown up really hard in disadvantage. And Pichu really is really good at keeping you in disadvantage. So I'm curious to see as what the game plan is here from Poncho. Well, coming off fresh from from Droid who plays Pikachu, I'm, I'd imagine like some of that experience will transfer well here. Yeah. And we're kind of already seeing little bits of shade of that. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, I, I was about to say that Poncho's playing a lot more patient than I've recently seen him, but then he just randomly side beat up in the, in the L Wolf. So I'm not so sure what's going to go on here, but. You know, we'll see what happens. Oh, he doesn't have a jump? Oh, nah, it's he, okay. He, we he gets Fox. Back. He, he gets back. I'm not sure. He also doesn't have a jump here. He's going to have to rely on side B. Okay, nice down air off of the ledge. Oh, doesn't do any... I, no. I, I, I don't know what's going on. This is a kind of interesting. This is a partially new matchup for El Wolf, so... It so. kind of looks like they're both playing very uh, hesitant. Oh, but that there will get the kill. Most of this is going off on... Download and trying to get a feel for how they perform. Yeah, like so. I think the the first game will definitely be a, a feel each other out kind of game, and Boncho really just going up for up smashes is not going to help him in this situation. Boncho really falling on some big habits right here. Historically, he's always been going for the big damage. He's willing to take the risk for it. Yeah. I almost expected him to go straight to ledge. Yeah. But Especially against Pichu, you don't want to take those risks. You actually gain less. Or like you lose more than you actually gain in this or in doing that. Well, but he, I mean, he ties it up only 77%. Now in 84. Oh, will he go for it again? Like this is the type of player Poncho is. He may, it may not have had any good idea, but he will go for it. Yeah. And it's his. I mean, it's not that bad of a play style, but I think against uh, people who catch onto it very quickly, I think it th then it becomes a liability more than a success. Oh, again, that's like the second time. Yeah, he's really going for these. Um, I, he's really, really going for these like side B's in neutral, and I don't know where he's getting the idea from, but it's not helping him at all. He's actually just getting blown up again. There it is, the side B. He's gonna take at least almost 40% for that. He really wants this combo. Like He really has to be careful. He can't just be throwing out those those very punishable moves willy-nilly. And like, I know it's Pichu. Like, like, just play it slow and you'll eventually get the damage you need. Yeah. Unfortunately... That was a good shine stall. Poncho kind of eating more than he bargained Ooh, for. Very good on Poncho, recognizing that a wolf has been landing with aerials this whole game. And now it's relatively close. He could bring this back. It's not that far behind. He could definitely bring it back. Oh, no, avoiding the when the change. A wolf kind of not overly committing. Yeah. Really. Oh, it actually go, works out <laughs> this time. Because El Wolf <laughs> decided to go for side B of all things. Oh, 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 okay. Oh, okay. So he's of... actually very close to dying. He could. He is Ooh. definitely very close to dying. No, that that split won't catch. He's definitely. Oh no! Kill. Yeah, he, Poncho really needs to stay grounded in these games. He can't be jumping willy nilly because El Wolf will definitely call him out for those things. But that ended up. That started off a little rocky, but. Eventually, kind of worked itself yeah, out. Yeah, it was actually kind of close. That, la that 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 first game was actually very close. It could have gone either way. I'm surprised with all the bad options, or not. Uh, yeah, they're kind of bad options. I'm surprised with all the bad options Poncho was doing. You know, he took it really close. Yeah. So, like, let's see if he'll actually choose to adapt. Though I feel he's probably gonna keep the aggro on again. Yeah. All right, so we're back at Battlefield. This is Poncho's counter pick. So we'll see how it works out for him. I don't know if this uh, oh, something what? going on. Uh, Controller malfunction. Uh, yeah, it looks like. Calm meditation. Uh, Tag in. Something going on. They're both. Okay, I think they're both oh, gentlemen okay. so into they're just, it. They're gonna start off, or are they gonna quit? No. What is going on? Oh, they're both. They're. Uh, I'm not so sure what's going on. Okay, so something's going on with their controllers. Okay. I'm not so sure what's going on. A little bit of uh, oh. Uh, okay, I guess we're yeah, just going to so restart. Gonna restart. Alright, just bring the game back. At least they openly say it. Not like when I realized I don't have the right tag or my button died. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm just like, oh, I guess we're playing with a handicap yeah. today. 
Yeah, if, if any of this happens in any of y'all sets, please make sure to tell your opponent don't don't play a game uh, without your tag, without your right controls, if your control's messing up, because then if you're playing on that, then that's on you. You're good on to your first stock. Yeah. All right, this is time for real. Lighter combos all day for both characters. Yeah, okay, so we're starting off relatively aggressive. Bones already at 41%. He jumps and actually gets clipped. He's going to have whoa. to up. Is this going to be... Oh, no, the tech. Great tech, great tech. Like, big explosive start right off the bat. Yeah, that was really... I think he went it up there, there, but he went for fair. Yeah, and, like, right now, Pichu just controlling the ledge right there. This time, choosing restraint to not jump. Okay, and so Boncho actually taking the lead here. Yeah, um, like... Oh, he up smashes again, risking everything for the biscuit. I'm telling you, it's not that optimal to do those things. It's a Boncho thing. He yeah. will do he it. He needs to really be careful with how many... Like on the buttons that he is pressing, because he cannot just really oh, nearly throw up smash like that. He will lose stocks for it. He needs to play patient. But your fox, I got caught again here with the up smash. He actually, he's putting himself in his own disadvantage, and that's oh, literally all no, he's doing. He is going to lose because of how un impatient he is. No, I believe. And there him it is with another smash attack. I believe in Portugal, but he does need to show restraint. He needs to be patient. And he's just going in. It's like he's doing. Oh, guess the back are gonna take it. Sixty percent though. That's a pretty sizable lead for El Wolf. Fox can bring this whole definitely. game back, but Fox he, can definitely rack up percent. But he really needs to play smart. And yes, he sir. Called out the grab right there with the down tilt. And he out okay. for the up B. Really smart. Like off stage, he is. Oh, catches Shit. the regular get up with. Forward smash, and this is going to be a really hard game for El uh, for Boncho to come back in. Like on stage, he does show patience and restraint, but on stage, it's like, no, we're going in. Yeah, and I get that you are a combo character, but you do need to show exercise Here it caution. Is with, the, here, with, with these, um, these are just not optimal options. Instead of just playing patient and waiting for P2 to do something, he's really just wanting to be up in P2's face with all these. Oh, necessarily unsafe options, and that's going to take it. it. A much so, faster Poncho, game. if you watch this, if you watch this over, I hope you do. You really need to stop playing so um, impatient. You know, 